up welcome back to my channel i'm back from my break it feels so nice to be back and for today's video i'm going to be doing acrylic painting on a canvas pad i've never used a canvas pad before from any brand this is my first time using a canvas pad and uh, i got this from itsy bitsy a4 size 10 sheets retails for you can see 699 almost 700 rupees so yeah without any further ado let's get started shades you need for this painting and i'm taking my beautiful palette water brushes like all of the sizes round brush flat brush all of the sizes Okay, this painting is all about using dabbing technique, like the whole background thing. So that is why I'm taking dark blue and, you know, using the dabbing technique and, you know, uh, doing it. You can just follow the video. You can see that I'm not painting and I'm not swatching it. I'm dabbing it. So yeah, just follow the tutorial. Hope you will, hope this is easy for you to read here. guys so right now i'm moving in with the regular cobalt blue shade this shade i'm gonna like in like you just follow me okay in these edges i'm gonna mix a bit of dark blue with that and paint and as we go higher i'll just lighten the shade i'll keep lightening the shade that is basically like uh, that is all about this painting it's very very easy you can recreate this background thing set in for overnight you don't have to like as soon as it dries you can start but i just left it overnight for better results because i don't know how this canvas pad thing works so yeah now i'm going to be doing the branches so let's get started
we're going to take lemon yellow, uh, lemon yellow white, put it over here, uh, kind of try and make a pastel Okay guys, so I'm just going to show you this painting up close. Yeah, you can see the branches are done. Okay, so let me tell you one thing about this canvas pad is that when you paint, like there are some white patches over here, which is not my fault. How much ever I paint, like it leaves a bit of white patch and that's just a bit annoying, but I will give you a proper review of this canvas pad. If you should or should not uh, buy it, by the end of this video, so stay tuned. review of this canvas pad should you buy it or not i would say don't buy it because you can see the pages are just like folding like this and this is not the best quality uh it's not the best quality but you can go for an indian brand this is not an indian brand i guess mont Marte, I don't know how to pronounce this, but I don't think this is an Indian brand. You can go for a Camel Kai or Camelin Kai. I'll just link a few canvas pads in the description box below. And you can also check out actual canvas, canvas, not canvas pad, like actual canvas, uh, for example. Okay, I've done a painting on this canvas. Besides, you can go for a canvas like this. It's really good. See, you are canvas. You can go for something like this rather than buying a canvas pad. This is my honest opinion. But you can try it out. I'll link a few canvas pad links in the description box below. But I'll meet you in my next video. Until then, think positive and stay happy. Bye.